Hi guys, today we're going to talk about Meghan Markle and Prince Harry. We're going to talk about the interview they gave to Time 100 Talk. It's not even an interview, they were interviewers as well. So they came together on that platform to talk about social media. Meghan and Harry were asked how are they doing and what they're doing during this pandemic. They reiterated what they said before, which is that they're taking this time to uh, to watch Archie grow, to watch him walk, watch his first steps and uh, to see how happy he is. He's a happy little boy and just to stay together as a family and be closer to each other, which they might not have had the chance to do had it not been COVID-19 or the corona. And also the editor of Time 100 Talks asked them how Meghan Markle and Prince Harry came up with the idea of having a talk about social media. And what the couple said is that they were in contact with professionals regarding social media, how hate is spread throughout the internet, how it affects people mentally, it affects their mental health, and how from Meghan Markle experience, how hate is disseminated, and also how fake news are created in order to put forward a certain agenda. And it's very difficult to trace where that hate came from, because when one person says something, it's sent out to the internet and then picked up by so many different peoples and millions of people. So it becomes so difficult to trace it back to the original person. This talk was about the internet, the digital platform that is the internet, social media, and how people consume social media, consume the internet without really thinking about the consequences of that on people's health, people's mental health. The Sussex said that it's a global pandemic that people don't see because we don't see the uh, effects of that pandemic right now. And it's going to be visible in the months and years to come. So they were talking about how we are in a matrix we don't even know exists, that some people don't know how to get out of. Some do get out but by using extreme measures and they talked about how political groups use it to their advantage how spinning out fake news is used to target certain people is used to smear other people and we thinking about the smear campaign towards Meghan Markle and she's the right person to talk about it whenever she talks about how she's being treated people say that oh she's talking about herself it's all about herself it's not all about herself it's something she can talk about because she's the victim of she cannot talk about something that she has an experience when Meghan Markle says yes I know the effects of uh, bad publicity of uh, fake news she does know what she's talking about because she's at the center of, of that smear campaign against her she can only talk about what she knows and what she experienced so when she does all that meetings and uh, talk it's just to show people that yes this smear campaign this fake news this hatred around the internet does exist she is the victim of that as well prince harry to some extent so yeah it was a very eye-opening conversation eye-opening virtual summit and if you haven't watched that please do go and uh, watch it. it it's just sad that a lot of hatred has been spinned out around the internet and people feel powerless anywho I hope I've summed up what happened in that video. I'm going to put the link to that video in the description box. Feel free to go and watch it. Hope you like the video. Feel free to click on like if it's the case. Subscribe for more videos and click on the notification bell. Please also do comment. Thank you.